my question was, what is denture odor? What causes denture odor? That's how I got down the big rabbit hole of this. Today we're going to talk about these cleaners. Oh my gosh. This one's upside down. Today we're going to talk about these cleaners and what they all have in common. That's our video for today. Uh, I'm going to put them all down before I drop, drop, drop them all. In today's video, we're going to talk about denture cleaners and what it means when it says kills 99.9% .9 of odor causing bacteria. We're, we're going to talk about that because... I started researching this back in the summer or spring and I've done a lot of reading. I've done a lot of reading. And what I have found out is all these denture cleaners down here, let me show you. This is the Centrifit Polydent Dr. B Liquid Crystals. This is from the um, 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 Olympifix. Secure sent me some cleaners, the Effortant back here and other ones that I've used. They all have a similar ingredient in them and that is persulfate. Whether it be potassium peroxy monosulfate, potassium monosulfate, potassium monopersulfate, or potassium persulfate. They're basically all the same thing and what that is is an oxidizer. That is found in like hair dyes, non-chlorine pull shock. It's found in in that too, these persulfates. A persulfate, what, what is a persulfate? Another word for a persulfate is a peroxide. They've done studies over time. They're finding that the peroxide breaks down the acrylic on the denture. It's a slow process, but, but that does happen. There is one difference though. All of these, hold on. These cleaners, all these tablet cleaners, have a chemical in them that is called sodium bicarbonate. What sodium bicarbonate is, is when you drop your denture tab in, you see all the bubbles coming up? Well, those bubbles are filling with carbon dioxide, and what they're doing is breaking on your denture and exploding, all those little bubbles. So all those little bubbles are acting like cleaning agents in themselves because they're breaking, they're breaking all over your denture. You can't see them. There's like really tiny bubbles, some of them, but they're cleaning your denture also, along with all this other stuff and along with citric acid. A lot of these cleaners, they all have citric acid in them too. There's two forms of citric acid, the anhydrose and the monohydrate. One is a water base and one is a powder base. That's all. The citric acid kills the bacteria, viruses, and it's also using insecticide. Uh, I've learned a lot about all these cleaners. So anyway, back to the sodium bicarbonate. The denture tab, you drop it in, all these little bubbles are dropping in, and that's happening. It's cleaning your denture. Dr. B's does not. This doesn't have sodium bicarbonate in it. So when you pump his liquid in, you really need to get his Swanee cleaner. And I think he sells it in a package. And I know a lot of people love this. Keep using it. I mean, if you love this, keep using it. The ultrasonic cleaner actually uses sound waves any ultrasonic cleaner does. It produces these sound waves, kind of like a dog whistle, a high pitch, a high pitch, and it just starts vibrating the water and making those little bubbles. The bubbles in an ultrasonic cleaner implode, whereas the sodium bicarbonate, they're exploding. They're exploding on your denture. This one's imploding. That's the difference in all of these cleaners. It's the sodium bicarbonate in the way that the dentures are cleaned. These are good. Effortant has the ADA seal of approval. The ADA is not going to approve something that isn't good for you, that kills all the bacteria and all of the everything. This is ADA approved. This one isn't. I'm not saying this is bad either. So keep using your liquid crystals if you like this. I just want to tell you that it's the packaging. Right here, it kills 99% of germs that cause denture odor. My question was, what is denture odor? What causes denture odor? That's how I got down the big rabbit hole of this. This will do it. It'll do it just like Dr. B's will, and this one will, and this one will. It, it'll do it. It just does it in a different way. If you can't afford to get an ultrasonic cleaner and, and all of that, if you can't afford that, because dentures are expensive. They're freaking expensive. This is good. This is, this is a good product. This is a good product. It'll do what it says. Now, with me saying that, rinse. You need to, with any of these that have the persulfates in them, you need to rinse and rinse again because I'm testing out a whole nother cleaning system here. None, none of these. A whole nother cleaning system here that I've been using for about two weeks. I'm really liking this. I'm really liking this. I'm coming with this. I'm coming this, with this because it's good and I really like it. It's not a brand deal or anything. I bought it myself. I found it myself during all of this reading and stuff. And it's not, a, I just bought it myself because I wanted to try it. You can feel safe using any denture cleaner. 
rinse. Oh, rinsing. I was, we were rinsing. What happens if you don't rinse good enough? The cleaner, it, it stays up in the pores of your dentures. And what that does is it affects your gums. So if you have sore gums or just your gums are irritating, then rinse your denture cleaner better. It doesn't matter which one it is. Just rinse it better. And then rinse it again. Scrub it and rinse it again. Because that's important because your blood-brain barrier is it's so close to your blood brain barrier here and you don't want anything traveling up into your brain i'm not saying it would but it's close enough that you need to rinse and just brush and rinse brush and rinse i hope this made sense to you guys i hope it explained what it means to have and kills 99.9 .9 of odor causing bacteria just know that companies have put a lot of research into what it kills and what it does these are all good they're all going to do the same this one doesn't have sodium bicarbonate in it by the ultrasonic cleaner. All the rest of them do, sodium bicarbonate. I hope that explained a little bit what what's happening here. I, I, I don't know. But everything is good. Purchase what you can afford. That's all. Dentures, it's expensive to have dentures. By the time you buy the dentures, and then you buy the cleaner, and then you buy the adhesive, and you buy everything else, dentures are expensive. Somebody emailed me recently, Lynette, because <clears throat> they had just got a full mouth extraction and the immediate dentures on the top. She's like, I feel like I'm babysitting a two-year-old with these. Yeah, that's kind of right. You're kind of right there. Use what you can afford. I'll see you in my next video. Subscribe because I'm going to bring this other cleaning system that I found that actually I've been using and my gums feel different. They feel good. So subscribe. That is coming and I'll see you in my next video.